And the answer is it's likely to be recessive. This is a stop protein, and it's going to, having only one functional stop protein, is likely to be enough to still control the growth of the cell. So what we've done, we've talked about cancer and the great genetic diversity of cancer. Um, different types of cancer are caused by mutations in different kinds of cells. They cause the cells to grow when they shouldn't. So cancer is fundamentally a genetic disease caused by somatic mutations. The other cells in the body, the cells that aren't part of the tumor, are normal. They have not got the mutations that cause cancer. Although, as we'll see in the next lecture, the, somat the other tissues in the body may carry mutations that predispose the develop to the development of cancer. So coming up next, we're going to talk about cancer risk factors. I hope to see you there.